Are you serious? You're telling me that isn't a barn? What is wrong with this game? Hello there everyone, my name is Rose Monkey, and welcome back to The Sims 3. I just got really confused because it opened here and I was looking at it like, where, where's the land? Where, where? I didn't get a holiday bonus. Okay, well that's what I was about to say. I, I just, I was like, where is the ground? But I didn't actually realize that last time we left it off, it was apparently snowing. All right then, snowflake day has arrived. Well, this is a bit premature because it's not actually Christmas IRL, it's kind of the 1st of October today. So, Halloween time. Not not for like another month, end of the, you get what I mean. So I figured that since we are in October and Halloween is at the end of this month, uh, you're hungry, um, today we would do a Halloween or Spooktober themed uh, Sims episode. Um, so when she's finished stuffing her face, I will show you the custom content that I downloaded and we'll see about getting her into some kind of Halloween costume. Why do you do the dishes in the bathroom sink? I gave you a kitchen sink! Did, didn't I? Did I? Oh, I didn't. Oh, that might be why. Okay, so this is the first outfit we've got, a pirate outfit. Apparently, I can't change her hair or her hat in here, so you're just going to have to use your imagination <laughs> with that one. Uh, when we pick a final costume, I will change the hair to reflect it. But that is the pirate outfit. I kind of like the, the layout of the top. I'm not sure about the skirt. Uh, the boots are not part of the outfit. I just added those in because they fit. You can just about see I did also give her hoop earrings as well. Very piratey. Um, but, like I said, without the hair up, it kind of... you can't get the full effect. Next we have Alice in Wonderland. Um, I love this dress. You can also have it in sort of the red and black um, shade, but you'd obviously have to change the tights for that. Uh, so this book goes better with the, look, the tights and the shoes. Um, so yeah, you can dress as Alice Little from Alice Madness Returns. Um, Alice in Wonderland. I really like the... Um, I'm quite, a, I'm quite a big Alice in Wonderland fan. Um, not just sort of the games, but the books, the whole entire thing. Uh, so this is very tempting. Um, I have to admit I do like it. I may well come back to this one. Not quite as taken by this one though, <laughs> I have to admit. Um, I literally just got this one for uh, curiosity's sake. Um, you can see the tattoo on her back, although you can't really make that out very well. Uh, but eh. I'm not really a mermaid kind of person. I have to admit this was the outfit I was most tempted to go to. I'm not too sure about the mismatched uh, stockings that are part of the outfit. They, they they were part of the boots, the stockings that... Uh, we should probably go for the full outfit, but in order to do that I'm gonna have to go um, back into the uh, real world outside of the wardrobe and um, change her hair and hat. Just make sure I've got all of the jewellery that I want before I do that. Give her some little witchy bangles, a necklace, and she's still got those hoop earrings in, but I might change them to silver because that matches her, um... Yeah, that matches better. Or I might make them smaller. I'll give, her, I'll give her the little ones. We'll see what happens when I give her the hat. Yeah! Now where... where's... where's... I need a mirror, don't I, to change my hat. Where's my mirror? Oh, that would have worked really well with the mermaid. Hair with, like, seashells in it. Okay, so there's already a witch's hat. Why is that? <laughs> the necklace is just floating. There's already a witch's hat, um, but that's not the one that came with the outfit. I'm looking for the one that specifically came with the outfit. Here we go. Her hair is, like, weird like that, long and straight, but... Yeah, that's the one that came with the outfit, and I really like the sort of, um, it looks a bit paganish. It looks, I just, I like the, the style, the whole, the whole thing. I do like it. Oh wait, there's even like a really cool top hat that I could have had with the Alice outfit. Oh. Or you could have it with the shorter hair. But yeah, I, I think we'll stick with the, uh, with the witch's outfit. It's really weird. Because I don't look like me anymore. She doesn't look like me anymore. Because my hair is not that long. But, you know, we're, we're all Halloween up. That's the main thing. What are you doing? 
Stop playing games and play with Monty. You need to make sure he's doing okay. <laughs> As per usual, all of the links to the outfits can be found on my Tumblr uh, list, which is linked in the description below for all of the costumes that I've shown you. Um, but yeah, for today, I think... Well, first of all, if I'm a witch, I'm going to need a cat, aren't I? Um, so I'm going to get some money together and I'm going to adopt a cat. Okay, so before I buy a cat, I obviously need to get the stuff for a cat. Uh, oh, it has them all listed. Cats, dogs, horses. Um, well, first of all, we need a scratching post because they do have the urge to scratch do cats. Uh, cheapo chow bowl. Pet toy crate. What is this? Collection of playthings for cats and dogs. Didn't know that was a thing. Uh, I don't really have room for it, but... Oh no, it's only small. Oh, that's okay. So the little box can go in the bathroom. You don't want a dog, a dog bowl, you want a cat bowl. Why do they all have bones on them? Bow wow! No! Cat! Kitty! Little critter. We'll go for the little critter pet bed. It's a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. Um, is it going to fit there? Yeah, why not? It's good. You can have a blue food bowl and it can go there. A kitty bag. I don't understand what this is. Is it like a pet bed? I don't know. I don't understand what this is. Well, I want to get it. I want to know what this is. Okay, it goes that way. I want to find out what that is. Okay, so we have a bunch of stuff. Um, now, we just need to get the cat. Adopt a pet from the shelter. Yeah, stop playing games, you have to adopt an animal. Time to adopt a pet. Oh, they're all so cute. Ratchet. Kawaii cat. <laughs> they're all so cute, but I'm not sure if they really yell witch's cat. I can't remember if there was a pet shop anywhere. I don't think there was. Oh, is there an event going on? There's always an event going on. Ooh, neighbourhood pet adoption. Can I go here? Oh, isn't this the place I went to before? I had all the kitties meowing on the inside. But there's nobody here right now. I want I want to go here. Gladstone is out at the moment. Is that is that him there? No, that's a gnome. It's fine, I'll just stand outside and be cold. Oh, there he goes. I literally just missed him. Oh well, I'm sure he'll come back. It's great. It seems like I'm basically spending Christmas Day hanging around outside some strange guy's house, waiting for him to get back so I can adopt a cat. I don't think this guy is ever coming home, is he? Oh no, there he is! Ding dong! Kitty cat, please! You sound like Santa. You look like Santa! <gasps> what is that? Okay, uh, we are allowed inside this guy's house now. <gasps> he has little kitty cats. Can they has one, please? What are they? Fred cat. I want to look at the kitty! They're so cute! How do I... Oh, wow. Yeah, hi. I'm a witch. I would like a witch cat, please. Is he dressed in a suit? He's dressed in a suit. After all that, I'm not even that sure about these. Thank you. It was very nice meeting you and your cats. I may be in touch. Oh, my computer's broken. When did that happen? Well, that sucks. Repair technician will arrive in about an hour. You let yourself in, right? You, you'll do that. See again, this is what I love about The Sims. You don't even have to be awake. They just let themselves into your house. It's fine. All better. Thank you. <laughs> Whoa. What? 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 Okay. Yeah, that's fine. That'll be 50 bucks. Why are you yelling? Oh, great. Now my toilet's broken. Or is it? No, apparently it's not broken. Why are you so excited about everything? Nothing's happening. Why would I want to buy a water slide? It's still winter. There's snow outside. Oh, we're going to see Monty, okay. Who's the most adorable snake in the world? Yes, you are. 
Oh, you Aww. so don't do that with snakes. But never mind. I think if I put my snake near my face like that, she'd just be confused. She'd be like, what are you doing? What happened? What happened? Oh. Oh, 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 dude, 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 deal with it. Deal with this. Oh, good, she actually put Monty back this time. Last time she kind of just put him in her pocket and walked off. I can hire an acrobat? Why? Yay, my cat's arrived! Mardunsa. <gasps> oh my god. No, I don't care about you. <gasps> oh my god, he's so smart! Stop, stop being in fast forward. I have to enjoy this moment. Look at her just carrying him around like that. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> Wait, bills? Okay, sorted. So, yeah, welcome to the family, Tibbles monkey. Um, oh, is he a little bobtail? He's a little bobtail. Oh, he's so cute. Look at him go. So we now have a cat. Yeah, that's exactly how excited I feel about this. So we're a witch, we have a cat, what else can we do? We should make pumpkins. She really seemed to like that before. Oh, now she's playing with the snake. Yeah, Monty's adorable. We know Monty's adorable. Yeah, but Tibbles wants to sniff you. Monty monkey can wait. Tibbles monkey needs attention. Did she just say no? Did you hear that little meow? I'm too excited about this. It's it's like a computer cat. It's not even real. But look at it go! Look at the kitty! Okay, enough playing with a computer. You need to read your last newspaper and then you've done all five newspapers. How is your career going, by the way? Up a tiny bit. Stories and reviews. I need to, like, write stuff. Interview Gladstone. I need to find him. I need to interview him. Mr. I have lots of um, kitty cats. We have to interview him. I'm carrying Monty again. Why am I carrying Monty? Put him away. Tibbles is so small I actually have to like click on his little thing to find him. What's wrong with you? Are you afraid of my snake? <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. Let's get to know the maid, shall we? Hi, yeah, I'm the crazy lady that's just dressed as a witch for no reason. In the middle of winter. You want to go to the bathroom? I can go- Oh my god. Look at that face, though. You're so small, I can barely see you. To be fair, I actually think that's the most intimidating thing ever. I'm not sure I would be comfortable hiding in there. Oh my god. Seriously. How cute is that? Oh, it even lists me as his mother. What? Oh, he's completely dwarfed by the bed as well, look. I need a bigger house. I could fit more pets in it. Okay, so I may have extended my house a little bit. But I'll be able to fit more stuff in. That's the main thing. Although I think I have to wait for myself to wake up. Before I can, like, move the bed back. There we go, I moved things around a bit. I got another one of these shelves. Uh, I can't remember how to move those up and down. Okay, I've moved Monty over here as well so that we can maybe do something with the kitchen. Ah! What are you yelling at? Oh. Oh, okay, that's what she's yelling at. But yeah, we could maybe do with reworking the kitchen a bit, getting um, another unit, getting a sink in there. Um, yeah, maybe just <laughs> fix that a little. There we go. I have absolutely no money left, but at least now I have a sink. I think the cat's in the way, and that's why she can't finish her waffles. Ugh, can you move then? Ooh, he's in the military. He doesn't really look like a military type, you know, with the suit and tie and everything. Okay, I'm interviewing him for work. He has commitment issues. I'm not gonna ask you out on a date then, dude. Uh -huh. Handy. I thought that said hairy for a minute there. Okay. Well, now we're done with the um, interview. And I've discovered that you're probably not a compatible dating partner. Let's just... Be growled at. <laughs> she just batted him in the head with 
with the newspaper. That's amazing. Okay, we're all done with the interview and I'm being harassed by a werewolf. I think it's time to go home. Well, before going straight home, I kind of decided, yeah, I did want to um, carve a pumpkin, didn't I? So, ah, carve a pumpkin. Let's, uh, let's get a pumpkin, head back home and carve it. Oh, great, it's another full moon. Very spoopy. I guess now's the perfect time to do that pumpkin, then. Okay, I'm just gonna, like, put this out here and hope that it wards off any unwanted spirits. Look, it's got a kitty face on it. So yeah, I'm dressed as a witch, I have a cat face pumpkin lantern, and I have a cat. And a snake. A very witchy, in a way. So that's about all we have time for for this episode. Um, because I have to go out shortly. Uh, hope you guys have enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. If you have enjoyed it, then give that like button some love, and I'll be back with more Sims very, very soon. Happy October! Bye! Um, I won't be going out there. What? Oh. Okay. Hi. Dude. Is that her head and spine that Gretel's holding there?